that sort of outside who would have, you know, gone a, a, a you know, different path or, or just felt different than others. Uh, and the fact remains it could have been any one of us in this room, you know. Uh, if that guy with the power decided to point the finger at you and, and you know, more fingers uh, continued to uh, point at you, um, you're done for. And that's essentially what happened, uh, that, you know, they just, you know, almost blindly just closed their eyes and pointed their fingers and happened to be in Damien's direction. That's why I think, you know, with something like this, as, as absurd uh, as uh, everything that has you know, surround, surrounded such, first, such an abominable crime, then such a, uh, an, uh, a grave injustice, um, it would be easy for any one of us to sit there and watch a documentary, let's say this documentary, watch the thing and go, oh my God, isn't that horrible? And then, you know, you, you, know, you reach for a french fry. Um, but I think the thing to do is when you are, when you recognize the truth, especially in something as intense and as grave as this, this step is to move forward, move forward, write letters, make phone calls, um, support, and uh, support, support these, these three innocent men. And, uh, Let's, let's work together for total exoneration for these folks.